Hey guys, so today I have swatches of the new ILNP Nightlife Collection. There are six magnetic polishes here. These are available right now, so I will link the ILNP website down below and I will get into the swatches. As always, these are the boxes that the ILNP nail polishes come in. The first polish is called High Roller and this is described as a black based purple magnetic with holographic flakes. I am swatching these over some gel extensions, so great formula here, really strong magnetic pull and a good coverage outside of that magnetic pull as well. I much prefer when a magnetic polish doesn't go super sheer after it's magnetized and the black jelly base in this one actually covers really well. It built up really nicely for me in two coats, covered completely. The black is very, very black, which also helps those holographic flakies stand out really nicely. So that is two coats of high roller. The next polish is called After Hours, and this is a black based deep blue magnetic with holographic flakes. Since these are pretty much all the same finish with very few differences in between, I might end up blowing through these kind of quickly. So this one covered really nicely. Again, really strong magnetic and really good coverage from the black jelly. Built up really nicely in two coats, covered completely for me. Same as the other one, nice strong magnetic, nice black base, and the holographic flakies stand out really nicely. I feel like the magnetic pigment in this one is very strong. It's a very crisp line, but it just blends into the black base a little bit more, so it's not quite as like in your face. So that is two coats of After Hours. The next polish is called Roulette, and this is described as a black based red magnetic with holographic flakes. Again, good coverage, good magnetic pull. I do feel like the base in this one is just a little bit smokier, a little less opaque than the last two. That being said, it's still built up fine for me. It covered completely for me in two coats, but I do think there was just a little bit more room for error on that black base. It wasn't quite as fully, fully covered as the last polishes. I was still fine with two, but I wouldn't be surprised if the very picky wanted three of this one just to get that base as deep as possible. So that is two coats of roulette. The next polish is called VIP, and this is described as a black based teal magnetic with holographic flakes. Again, great magnetic pull, really good coverage here. The black base is also still very black. I feel like this is a little sparklier than previous shades. There just seems to be slightly more holographic glitter going on in there. This built up really nicely, covered really well on that second coat, and the abundant holographic flakies stood out really nicely against that black jelly base. So that is two coats of VIP. The next polish is called Jackpot, and this is described as a black based gold magnetic with holographic flakes. Again, a great formula. This had that slightly more sheer, smokier looking jelly base to it like Roulette did. It's not quite as deep and dark as the other polishes. It still built up fine for me in two coats, but like Roulette, I wouldn't be surprised to see if you wanted three for this one. If you have really long nails, maybe are swatching it over a more clear gel extension, or just really want to get that base as dark as possible, although I still think it's going to be two coats for most people. So that is two coats of Jackpot. And the last polish is called Jet Setter, and this is a black based pink magnetic with holographic flakes. Same as the other ones, very opaque black jelly base on this one, very strong magnetic and really good scattered holographic. It goes on very smoothly and very evenly. The black base built up really nicely, covered completely in two coats, and those holographic flakies stood out really nicely as well. So that is two coats of Jet Setter. And since these kind of all have the same finish and there are some similar colors, I wanted to show polishes within the same collection together as well because I don't have a ton of comparisons to make. So this is After Hours and this is VIP. You can see After Hours leans much more blue, VIP is more teal, and then here I have Jet Setter and High Roller so you can see the comparison with those two as well. These are actually pretty close. High Roller is a bit more purple but it's still very purpley pink. The shift in there has purple and pink to it. Jet Setter is that strong magenta pink shimmer. And these all shift and shift a bit differently, but there is like a predominant strong main color to all of them. So I don't have a ton of comparisons to make here because these are all magnetics. So I tried to stay within other magnetics in my ILNP collection. And so I don't have a lot of like exact anything really. So for Jackpot here, I pulled out this one called Venom. This is a much 
more true green magnetic stripe to it, where Jackpot is much more gold and has a bit more of that holographic sparkle to it. So for Roulette here, I pulled out Poison. Roulette has a kind of coppery red multi-chrome shift to the stripe. Poison has a very, very red stripe and is obviously in this red jelly base, which gives it a completely different look. For VIP here, I pulled out Deep Space. Deep Space has more teal, like predominantly teal magnetic stripe, but if you look at it in the light, it also is a bit of a like multi-chrome magnetic stripe, so there's some strong purple on either side as well. So the predominant color here is very close, but Deep Space has that multi-chrome effect. So I think Jet Setter is going to be my favorite here. Even at the bare bones, the pink magnetic stripe in this one I think is my favorite color out of all of them, but it also had a slight little bit of shiftiness to the magnetic stripe. It was kind of hard to pick up, but it could go a little bit more red-orange and a slightly more green depending on the angles that you were looking at it from, and I think all of those colors together I think looked the best in this kind of finish. So that is the ILNP Nightlife Collection. Again, I will link the ILNP website down below where you guys can check those out. They are available right now. Hope you guys enjoyed this one and I will talk to you later.